Okay, so this is typical Daisy Ridley, although she's not been in the news for a, for a very long time. She's currently in the news because she's attacking Ted Cruz, who defended Gina Carano. Um, she she makes very crappy reply. Uh, I wouldn't even uh, I wouldn't even say that. I wouldn't even say that that is even a way to to defend whatever Ted said because whatever Ted said was actually the truth. Uh, what did Ted say? Ted said Texan Gina Carano broke barriers in Star Wars universe. Not a princess, not a victim, and not some emotionally tortured Jedi. Tweeted Cruz referring to Ridley Scott's in training ray basically she she is the mary sue of uh, the of the star wars universe uh a, a, i i actually call ray's uh, character a mole that was planted by the the bloody witch called kathleen kennedy into the star wars universe she never needed to exist her character was so useless that it never needed to exist um seven years six seven years after the first force awakening movie she's pretty much the, one of the most unremembered useless character that has existed in the star wars universe the only time people remember ray is the only time people remember ray is whenever whenever people just want to make fun of her character because everybody that actually likes ray and uh, the Ray Low fans are actually weird people. They, these people are, are, are freaks. Uh, these people are Twitter freaks. They have no jobs. They are, they are teenagers that that, uh, that that can't even decide what pronouns they, they want to have in their bios. That's pretty much the idiots that, that Disney currently are pandering to. So, um, Cruz added that Colonel's character, Cara Doom, played by a woman who kicked ass and who, who girls lo looked up to. She was instrumental in making Star Wars fun again. Of course, Disney canceled her. Now, you go on to see um, the Raylo Ridley reply in a very weird way weird and cringy way uh, i'm very happy to be emotionally tortured jedi who doesn't leave their state when it's having a terrible time Re uh, says ridley uh, pretty much look you need to understand this ridley uh, daisy ridley is a very much one of the most irrelevant and uh, very much an unremembered character that will forever be non-existent to the real star wars fan she she has never been able to to sell merchandises she has never been able to be liked by the general public and one of the reasons why she has been forgotten to be honest is because she even though she was a mole that was planted by Kathleen Kennedy she never really portrayed herself to the general public like someone we should root for she has never been one to to even behave in a way that major people should actually care about her as a human being she has never done that she has always been that reclusive um how would I put it kind of like no it I, I really don't want to attack this lady too much but i and to be honest i i wouldn't even say the the downfall of star wars is all her fault she's pretty much an actress that was like i said planted by kathleen kennedy into the star wars universe she never really needed to exist and even if she had to exist she needed a very good script writer and a very good director to actually put her through the paces of a good story for her to make sense to the general public it's, it's not the rubbish they made out her out to be 
So let me not go too deep into bashing her. I, I, I will just say her statement is very silly, very immature. And uh, it's just the only way she can cry for her for her irrelevance in the society right now. And I think uh, in some of her recent tweets, she's, I think she's tweeting or not tweet. I, I don't know. I think one of her interviews, like she, she's like teasing that she may return or something like that. And she's the same person that said, I think it was a year ago that she was never going to come back to the Star Wars universe. And I really don't want her to be back. I, I honestly feel that she is the worst character ever produced in the Star Wars franchise. Um, her character was a forced agenda that never should have existed. Um, that's why she's never remembered and she would never be respected in the fan community. Um, I'm sorry, but it's just the truth. At least I'm quite nice compared to other YouTubers that call her name names uh so it is what it is she's never really gonna be liked and she's not putting herself to be in a position to be liked by anybody so we will see what ends up happening if they would make a show about ray i doubt anybody would really care or watch a show about ray uh, except maybe the ray look weirdos on twitter since disney pandas to those morons these days I wouldn't be surprised if that is the next direction that they go with. Please subscribe to our channel. Do like our content. Follow us on social media. I'm going to see you guys next time.